Good afternoon beer buffs and today I'm reviewing Lander Park Pills, a nice pills now, from Wild Barley Brewing. So let us get a pour on. Yes. Ready for a nice pour from one of my favourite breweries right now, uh, Wild Barley Brewing here in San Antonio. So I've been there today for our uh, San Antonio team meeting and lunch. So I thought I'd pick up a four pack and do a little review for you folks. So, and I have, I have my Wild Barley tankard, or what do you call it? A stein, wild barley stein. So I've got that from Oktoberfest last year. So I thought it's very appropriate, right? Have it in that, have it. Um, yeah, I won't beat around the bush, folks. This is one of my favorite beers currently um, on this side of things. So don't expect a low rating. <laughs> um, but I just wanted to share it with you and talk a little bit about the brewery. So yeah, there we go. Let's have a taste, eh? Before we get into the nitty gritty of it all, as I like to say. Uh, what a lovely autumn, it's not autumnal yet, but a, what a lovely afternoon. It's not too warm anymore. I've moved my chair slightly. So I'm normally a little bit further that way, but the light, I was catching a light. It's getting a little bit later, so just that standard lagery smell which um, always makes me happy <laughs> sorry suggest this a little bit yeah um, beautiful taste on it this is a tasty la a lager pilsner got a bit of a bite to it refreshing how a pilsner should be sharp that is just nice that's just tasty yeah i bought a full pack uh today they've got their little fridge loaded with different beers that they do um but the lander park is one of their kind of go-to beers i would say there. there's a few others i'll talk about those in a bit but yeah i mean they're, so they're based on broadway um they kind of specialize in in uh, baking, wild barley, uh, so they do a, lo a lot of bread, sourdough, lo loaves, pizzas, um, lots of sandwiches on their menu, um, really good first class food, I'll tell you that for nothing. Um, what did I have today? I had a wonderful BLT and it was on a sourdough bagel, oh my god, um, but I like their Reuben sandwich. Um, and their burgers are fantastic, but good fresh bread. Normally when I go, I didn't pick up one today, but last time I was there, I picked up a lovely sourdough uh, loaf to take home and enjoy. So really is uh, great quality food, first class beers. The guys over there are just doing a sterling job on the brewing. Um, always so friendly. Uh, I do recommend you get over there if you get a chance. Um, good space as well. It's, it's right on Broadway, 410. Um, central san antonio um if you're not familiar to the area and uh, really easy to get to and it's just a nice space they've got um open area for seating they uh they have a stage for live music um and just just a good yeah a good place if you like football they show some of the football matches um as in soccer football uh, but they are actually if you're into german teams bayern munich that's their that's their location, so uh, <laughs> I'm I'm Tottenham Hotspur. I don't have a German team. Uh, I don't really have many. Uh, this is my uh, American team. Uh, uh, you know, league football, uh, San Antonio, um, of course. But yeah, it's I've never really supported uh, any German teams. Um, I do. Who does my um, oh? Ajax for my Dutch friend Yorick. Uh, I kind of, I don't follow them, but if I had to pick a team for the Netherlands, uh, that would be them. Um, 
Yeah, other than that, it's just that I, you know, I have a few teams in the UK. Obviously, Tottenham number one, but like I like to see how Derby County does, uh, which are, they're in the championship. And um, anyway, I'm digressing. I bore you. I, oh, and Wrexham, if you follow that, welcome to Wrexham. I do follow them as my Welsh team. There you go. Back to the beer. I was waffling a bit there, wasn't I? <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, gosh. I've had a couple of beers today at Wild Bali, so a bit gaseous, a bit gaseous. Uh, just a good solid beer, and it's um, it's a nice slow drink as well. You can enjoy and you can savor. There's no rushing about it. Very nice. Um, but yeah, please do check out Wild Bali if you get the chance. A few other beers that I enjoy over there, and. Um, you should definitely check out if you get the chance. Um, they have Safety Meeting, which is a hazy IPA. I had one of those today. Very nice, just top quality IPA, I gotta say. Um, Overnight Oats, which is a stout I've had in the past, really good. And they also have a lager called Flavor Corner, which um, is a nice go-to lager of theirs. And they always have mixing it up, so they have always different beers to try out. You know, they rotate a lot, so. And beers to go if you want to just pop in and grab some. But yeah, please do support if you get the chance. Wild Bali, fantastic folks. I did find out about their um, Oktoberfests this year. They have three weekends coming up. The last two Saturdays of September and the first Saturday in October. So um, I'm going to try and swing by there for one of those. Uh, I went last year with Steve Nose and... Um, the Frenchman, Lieutenant Dan, and uh, yeah, and uh, James came along as well, uh, J JT, and yeah, it, it's, it's a good, yeah, it's a good place. Uh, so I'm looking forward to going again and checking out some of their Oktoberfests. Obviously, that's where I got this one. So I'm going to try and swing by and check it out. <laughs> Excuse me. It's all coming up today. It shows I'm enjoying my beer. But yeah, this is solid. It's so calm here today, isn't it? Listen to the silence. Beautiful, wonderful. I'll be out here tomorrow. I've uh, we've got album club this week, uh, so after work tomorrow. Well, actually, I'm working with my father-in-law. We're building a greenhouse. Ooh, uh, that'll be fun. But yeah, I'll sit out here, have a few more beers and make my notes on Album Club. Um, what are we doing this, this month? There's the silence, spoiled. <laughs> uh, UFO, um, British band, so we're gonna, I've got one of their albums to check out. I've listened to it, I'm just gonna make my notes, but I just sit out here, put my Bluetooth on, and listen away, and scribble scrabble my notes for Album Club. But yeah, something to look forward to anyway. This guy's Lander Park pills. Oh, by the way, Lander Park is actually a, a park in New Braunfels, an iconic park there, which I discovered. I've driven past it quite a few times, actually. So that's where the name comes from, I'm, I'm guessing. Um, could be wrong, but I'm guessing that's the case. But yeah, so keeping it local. But anyway, yeah, my um, rating for this is fine pills now. It's a 9.5, it can't be anything less. It's possibly one of the best Pilsners I've ever had. It's that tasty, so. There you go. I will see you folks next week for something new. Until then, keep it crafty.